Someone want to tell me what's going on here? Who were those mercenaries? They were heavily armed and had access to C-Sex shuttles. I don't know. I've never seen them before. I can't believe you survived all that. They had guns. And grenades. And those drone things. It's all right. I'm calling Commander Bailey. See what's going on with C-Sec. Okay, that sounds... Wait! Wouldn't that just make whoever you contact a target too? She's right, Shepard. Until we know more, it would be a big risk. Okay. For now, we run this ourselves. Right. Ourselves. On our own. Outside the law. Okay. Yeah. Brooks, gunfire means something serious is going on. Can you keep it together long enough for us to figure this out? They said the medigel might make me jumpy. Also, the fact that I work a desk job and have never been shot before. How did you get mixed up in this? I monitored data for Alliance Intel to prevent fraud and hacking of officer IDs. Like, uh, someone using an Admiral's pass to get into a nightclub on the Citadel when that Admiral is fighting on Tichanka. I wrote a tracking program. It's really neat. I named it Mr. Biscuits, after my cat. Brooks. Right, sorry. Anyway, Mr. Bis- uh, My program detected a breach in your classified files. Soon, everything we had on you was compromised. Personnel files, mission reports, everything. Since when does hacking personnel records involve heavy weapon fire? Think of what criminals could do if they had Shepard's military access codes. Or Spectre codes, even. Explains why they need you dead, Shepard. Nothing to stop them till the damage is done. Guess we're back on the clock. Don't worry. We'll find a quiet evening for just the two of us when this is done. Okay. Ideas on where to start with these guys? Hmm. What about the pistol you picked up? For such a tiny thing, it packs a punch. Damn straight, it does. Never seen anything like it before. Let me see it. No. Oh. I might be able to help. Glyph. I'll begin collating relevant intel for review, Dr. Tassoni. Liara? Shepard, I'm relieved to see you're in one piece. Where's Garrus? A shame about the sushi place, though. It was a favorite. I hear that. All right, Liara's on point. What about the rest of the crew? Yeah, what about those slackers? Joker, you've been busy. I found some folks who actually like being shot at. Permission to come aboard, Shepard. <laughs> Damn straight. Nice. Speak to the squad mates. All right. Joker, did you get shot? Okay, later, when this is over and everything is settled, we are going to talk about this bait thing. I'm the commanding officer. That's all that matters. What's up, Commander? I'm not reading that again. What's up, Ashley? Glad Liara's on this. If anybody can sift through a mountain of boring stuff to find that one critical clue, it's her. Yeah, you're not wrong. Hey, Shepard. Tali? Back there in my pilgrimage, I used to walk around near that sushi place and watch the fish through the window. I knew they'd never let me inside, but I think to myself, Someday, when I've proven my worth to the galaxy, I'll go there for dinner. And then, you broke their floor. I didn't, they did. Fine, by the way. Glad to hear it. Try not to destroy any more of my childhood memories. And no promises. Hey. <laughs> hey, me. How's a beady? The restaurant attack has made the news. Civilian casualties seem to have been restricted to... Fish. Oh, no, not the fish. Hello, Shepard. Enjoying my sofa? Uh... Oh, when did you get here? I didn't see you coming to the door. Nothing beats having a Krogan bodyguard, huh? True. I had a buddy like that once. Uh, no, not so much a buddy, really. More of a prisoner who helped yeah. us. <laughs> it's a long story, man. Anyway... Brooke, she's kinda cute. Think she's on the market? No idea. Can you stop phasing through my countertop, though? Shepard. Shepard. <laughs> uh, where... Speaking of... Oh, it's Garrus. Where the hell did Rex go? But yes, very much a fan of having a Krogan bodyguard again. So, what was it, Shepard? Five minutes before someone started shooting at you? Garrus, I swear. On the other hand, we get this cool secret hideout to hang out in. Unless the bad guys look in the window. They'd be picking a really bad fight if they did, though, let's be honest. How's it going? I mean, I've just been shot at, fell down a, you know, kind of side of a skyscraper. 
all this other stuff. Javik, I didn't say you could come in here. A Brex. Bet you never saw a shuttle get taken down like that before. <laughs> Not wrong. <laughs> I still got it. Thought we were done with all the shooting on the Citadel after Cerberus messed the place up. They must want you bad, Shepard. Price of fame, I guess. Shepard? Shepard? Commander, in my cycle, when we fled combat by falling through tanks containing aquatic animals, we usually... Oh, right. We never did. <laughs> you are a trailblazer. Probably the most positive thing you've ever said. Commander. Uh, okay, well, we know there's the other guys downstairs. Where... Hmm, where's my bedroom? Can I... Do I unlock that pistol? Or are they still, like, researching it? Nobody in my shower? No? Good. Oh, no, new pistol. Which one is it, though? Not the Carnifex, right? No, that's the other one I bought. Predator, Scorpion, Arc. M11 Suppressor. Interesting. High damage. Actually, higher damage than what we've got now. Higher fire rate. Much more weight, though. Much lower capacity. The M11 Suppressor is the product of the Alliance's offensive handgun project that developed an, an infiltration weapon to be used in close quarter situations where silence is key. The suppressor features a built-in integral sound moderator that reduces noise and muzzle flash. Civilian variants of the weapon are considered illegal, but can be found in some sectors. Don't suppose I can put an extended barrel on it. Well then. I wonder if it keeps the suppressor, because that's cool. I like the sound of it as well. More mag size. More piercing. Melee damage, power damage, weapon weight. It would bring it down considerably, which would make it much more usable. But the six round mag is ugh. 60% of the six round mags. So you're talking like nine rounds a mag. Not great, but it does hit fucking hard. I'll take it for now. Um, where's my new toy? It's... There. Yeah. Yeah, just for when shit hits the fan. Keep that, because I still want to see if that actually gets utilised. Right, let's go chat at the makeshift war room, I suppose. Don't think I'm missing anybody. Oh, never mind. Cortez is in my library. I'm glad you made it out of that ambush, okay? None of us saw that coming. But, lesson learned. Never have dinner with Joker. It won't end well. Yeah, fair point. Glad you're okay, Shepard. Thank you. Who's messaging me? No one. Okay. Just blinking for no reason. Shepard, mm. I've found something. We can gather the team whenever you're ready. Yeah, all right. Hold on. I'm just looking around. What was that? Did I read that one? New questions. Yeah, okay, I did. And even if I hadn't, I probably wouldn't listen to it. Uh. I'm going to have to write a report about getting shot. I hear those are really complicated. It's faster if you make a template. I think maybe you get shot too much. True. I've made some progress. Would you like me to call the meeting? Yes. Do it. We have a lead. I called in some favors to run a trace on the gun. It led me to a casino owner named Elijah Khan. He's been suspected of using his profits to smuggle weapons onto the Citadel. Immediately after the attempt on Shepard's life, Khan made an interesting call. I'm cutting you off. I'm returning your down payment now. What's the problem? Turn on a vid screen. When I sell a gun, I don't want it showing up on the nightly news. You won't be linked to me. Save it. Our association is terminated. And if you even think of coming after me, I've got info on you ready for prime time. So you ponder that. Con out. So that's our identity thief. Looks like he's got an ID disguise. Right. Those things are a pain in the ass to get around. Did you get anything on the mercenaries who attacked us? They're a private military corporation called Cat-6. As most of you know, Cat-6 is an Alliance nickname for dishonorable discharges. Many have criminal records, histories of steroid abuse, and other charming features. No doubt hired by the thief, not by Khan. That phone call was pretty damning stuff. How'd you get it? 
It involved the weapons biometric data, Solarian intelligence, and a Hanar prostitute with camera implants. Oh god. Seriously? No, but the truth is boring. <laughs> okay. First joke I think she's ever made. Whoever that voice was, Khan's nervous enough to cut them loose. We can squeeze Khan until a contact drops out. Easier said than done. He has a panic room inside the casino, a good place to hole up. And? Edie can give us programs to hack the door, but the cameras and guards complicate things. Yeah. Khan could disappear. Or worse, if his guards ever open fire, normal people could get hit. Like I did. She's right. We can't risk spooking him. We go in quiet. Small team. No gunplay. Dr. Tassoni, this evening the casino will be hosting a charity event to assist war refugees. Purchase some tickets, Glyph. Then call up a layout of the building. Score! So, how close can you get? You don't usually put a back door in a panic room. This air shaft bypasses the security gate and ends up in storage. From there, the panic room's door camera can be disabled. Uh, too convenient. There's gonna be alarms all over that shaft. I believe I have some countermeasures that may help. I'll know more once we're inside. Who will go in this shaft? They need to be small in size. Yeah, that's not me. Too many snacks of roast varin leg. <laughs> I suspect my suit's built-in tech would be picked up by security sensors. Yeah, that's fair enough. My presence in the casino would arouse suspicion. Mechs are not allowed, since they can have cheating software. Okay, fair what enough. What you need is somebody trained in zero emissions tech. No electronics, no metal, just undetectable polymers. We had a course back at Op End, disabling a bomb with these little tweezers. See, the bomb was filled with shaving cream. All right, you're in. What? No. What? You said it yourself. We've all got too much tech. But... <laughs> I managed to get shot just coming to talk to you. Now I'm supposed to hack my way into a safe room? <laughs> yes. That's the plan, Brooks. Get whatever you need and be ready. If that's settled, it looks like there's one last hurdle to get us inside. Which is? Black tie required. Oh, okay. Squad selection. Oh, we can have Rex! He's going to be my bodyguard. Probably should have taken Talia as like a date, but... You know. Does Rex have like a suit? Oh, he does! Look ridiculous. Yes, you do. Think of it like camouflage. You don't want to scare the prey. Then we need to find bigger prey. <laughs> Okay, this is good. Everyone looks at the Krogan, nobody looks at me. He's a very big distraction. I'll get to the ventilation shaft. Wish me luck. Liara, you have any input? I'm here, Shepard. Edie and I will keep in contact in case we're needed. Khan has a lot of surveillance set up. I'd mingle with the guests if you want to look normal. Okay, Rex. Time to meet the riffraff. Mingle, mingle. Lots of mingling to do. All right, first we're gonna hit the bar. Let me. What do you have? Nothing too crazy. I want to be able to walk a straight line. Chastian Temple coming up. Are Asari drinks usually mild? Not all of them. Mr. Khan had us put out some gelatin shots earlier. Also Asari, they kick like a shotgun. Okay. Interesting. It's for a good cause. Every thousand you lose, that's a roof over the head of some poor human or borcha or whatever. I'm all for that, but if I'm not trying to win, where's the challenge? In taking the house, dear. Like I always say, each must try to gain as much as she can, then give as much as she can. Commander! Why, hello, love. Isn't the turnout amazing? I wasn't sure anyone would show up. We pull together when we have to. I feel so bad for the humans. If you need a place to stay or anything, you just let me know. Bitch. I have a place to stay now, but thanks. So you had nothing before that? Oh, how brave of you to endure, dear. The humans are so resilient. Like that phrase of theirs, 
Stiff one in the lips? <laughs> Stiff upper lip. Right, of course. What did I say? Jesus Christ. What is this? Please do not touch the waterfall. I don't want to touch it. Officer, sir. Okay, no small talk. Get it. So push my tour of the camp from one o'clock to three. Move the three to five, and we'll find ten minutes to eat somewhere. So to sum up, tomorrow starts with the Help a Dream Foundation. Then it's blood drive, refugee camp, and hospital tour. Hmm. Sounds like you turn pro. I try. Ms. Rios believes we have an obligation to the less fortunate. Of course. So, how are you liking the party so far? There's a party? Wow. Okay. Any more things to do? Hello. Evening, officer. Sir. Attention, bets are locked. Oh. Attention, all bets are locked. Game Good rules. Luck, ladies and gentlemen. Varen racing out of play. Select one of the four available Varen's place your bet. If the selected Varen wins the race, you receive a payout based on that Varen's odds of winning. Varen with a lower chance of winning, give higher payouts. I want to play. 8 to 1, 4 to 1, 1 to 1. Opti optimistically, we'll win. Do you take this kid? Oh, looks cool. On that one. Last call, people. Get your bets in. Oh, we'll get a big spender. Why not? A blistering start. Too close to call. Optimistically, we'll win. Wins. Wow, I got shafted. Do it again. Don't gamble, chat. Oh, go on. Doing better. Still not good enough. How many times am I going to have to do this to get a win? Get your bets in, Baron Race. Come on, bud. You got this. Come on. No, you're slacking. Come on. Come on. No, you kind of suck right now. Easy on the ring call wins. What a name. Come on, C-Sec Biscuit, you can do it. I believe. A blistering start. Come on. Come on. Go on. You can do it. I believe third. in you. Don't. You little bastard. Kruger wins. <sighs> I just want to see the big payout. Give me the endorphins game. Come on. Chunkin Princess. Wait, this is a different one. You're changing my Varen, how dare you? A dominant performance. We've gone with the princess. princess Alright, I'm tired of losing wins. money. Come on, let me out. Hello. Come on, Tiger Bite. Bring it home. You got a lot riding on him? He's my boy. Picked him up at a shelter. Whoever let him go had no eye for racers. He can outrun anything he can't outfight and outfight anything he can't outrun. What are the odds on him? Enough to pay for my kid's tuition. So you say. Hold on. Is he going to show up in the selection? Tiger Bite. Oh. Hello. Live holo feed start soon. A blistering start. Come on. 
So I'm gonna end up killing this guy. How fucking dare you. Optimistically, we'll win wins. You fucking suck. You were saying? So these hollows aren't just hollows, right? Real Varen are racing somewhere. Oh yeah. They set up a trap. Our pups eat. They bark. They need cleaning up. What's a pro racer eat? A special diet based on what they get in the wild. Minus the radioactive crap. So what? Raw Krogan leg? Oh man. My dogs would love that. Kind of illegal though. What do you mean kind of? Are there a lot of fights in Varen races? Only if something goes wrong. But I don't call my boy Tiger Bite for nothing. They throw at each other. You know, they grab and hold for dominance, but they don't actually break the skin. Sounds like quite a trick. Yeah, if I had teeth like that, I'd poke somebody's eye out. Evolution's a pretty amazing thing. All right, I'm tired of talking to you. Anything else cool going on? Still upstairs. Yeah, all Interesting. Right. You're not mingling and you're not betting. What's your game? The name's Roland Quarn. The game, Commander Shepard, is hearts and minds. Care to elaborate? Most people in this casino are here for a good cause. Others are just here to be seen. Phonies, if you will. They have money they won't miss. Others who are not myself need it. So the honorable thing to do is part them from this money. So you're a thief. So you're a con man. That too. Con men leave their marks angry. Con artists leave them smiling. You just admitted that to a spectre though, you know? I'm just gonna shoot you. Where's this? The fountain is decorative. Do not touch. Is it still Hanar piss? Fine. You know what? It's a Hanar urinal. Knock yourself out. What the hell is oh there's Rex. Anything else do here? Just waiting. Yeah. Brooks, they'll make me come up there pissed off. Evening, officer. Who's this? Sir. Roulette. How to play it. To start the game, place chips on one of the following bets. A single number, 0, 1, 2, up to 20. A range of numbers, 0 to 1, 1 to 10, or 11 to 20. Red numbers, red rectangle, black numbers, black rectangle. Single numbers return the highest payouts. Ranged bets return the lowest payout you may place up to three bets on the roulette table at which point the wheel spins you can place more than one chip on the same bet bets cannot be taken back once placed price to play 500 credits per chip hmm. sure i'll do one round why not i'll make some money back we're gonna go put one on black Go lucky number six. Oh! Gimme. I don't know how much I just done, but thanks. Plus 8,000 grip worth. Anything else? I heard your advice is so good at psychic. So what's going to happen to me in the next few minutes? Disappointment. <laughs> oh. Hey. Commander? Commander Shepard. Shaira. It's been a long time. My idea of a long time is different than yours, Commander. What can I say? I put a lot of living into the last few years. Indeed. Do you have any advice for me this time? When? I'm certainly trying. Commander. Have a drink. I think I once heard a rumor that you were leaving the Citadel. I did leave. Some so-called journalists made up stories about me. Because of their venom, I retired to a little colony in the Celia Nebula. Why come back? Because I knew people here, and they needed comforting. And because one does not flee the heart of the galaxy in desperate times. Not because of some scoundrel with a video camera. Just punch him is what I do. Why, Commander, you keep coming over. What is a lady to think? I was wondering, how does someone become a consort? By understanding the minds around you. By displaying compassion in every direction. And then trying just a little harder, and just a little longer, than anyone who is not a consort can possibly imagine. Now, if you'll excuse me, 
I have a potential client to attend to. I noticed. But no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just being ignored. Okay, fine. Anybody else? Oops, got stuck. He's like upstairs. Hello. Whenever you're ready. Uh, select the amount you wish to bet to start the game. The game starts you off with one to five points. You may then hit for either one to eight, four to seven points any number of times. The goal is to get as close as possible to 20 points without going over. Select your current payout to end the game. Wait, what? The game starts you off with one to five points. You may then hit for either one to eight. Oh, okay, so it's essentially like a dodgy blackjack. Oh, we'll go... Fuck it, big spender. Why not? Hmm. Sure. Sure, breaking even. Nice. Okay. Well. Hello. Hello. I'll call Oops. you back. Potential client here. Enjoying the party? Like adrenaline in my heart. They're gonna have a fire breather on the bar later and shoot fireworks above the ward. Would fireworks even burn in a vacuum? It worked at New Year's. Whatever they did, it looked freaking nuclear. Hmm. Okay. I think we've checked most of this. I guess I'll go upstairs. You stop getting Still stuck. Upstairs. I... Oh, I'm gonna shoot her. Hold on, there's more stuff to do. I think, maybe. Have a drink. Drinks are complimentary tonight, sir. Damn straight they are. Evening. What's popular tonight? Well, some adventurous souls are trying to mind fish. It's what Hanar like to do instead of alcohol. Huh. I guess since they're mostly water, the dehydration would be bad. Right. So there's this fish with hallucinogenic skin oil. Gets Hanar buzzed right up. What happens if humans eat it? way more potent and it releases into our system slowly best to clear your schedule for the entire weekend god damn all right um you know i respect the first guy who looked up at saturn and said that thing up there it isn't a star but you gotta love the guy who said that thing up there that's gonna be my gas station enjoying the party i'm very odd young people party i drink Tonight it's ring call on the rocks. That stuff can put you down for the count. I just lost a staggering amount of income. This puts things in perspective. You need a few credits for a ride home or anything? Oh no, it's not like that. You know about all those helium-3 facilities that are getting wiped out? I've flown by a few. Well, to put it in layman's terms, most of those facilities were mine. Huh, how... Thoroughly boring. <laughs> oh, even Rex is getting in on it. Fuck yeah. Let's go, Rex. He's still smoother than I am, though. All right, that's enough. Hello, love. Okay, right. Just like we thought. There's an alarm on the grate. We'll have to bypass it. Dr. Tassoni gave me this to pass to you. It's a resonance emitter lens. It should let you see security grids and wiring. Oh, oh Good. creepy. I'll follow the wiring to a junction box, splice it, and disable the alarm. Yeah. Fingers crossed. The lens is working. Good. That's cool. Follow the blue wiring. Blue In case it needs wiring. to be said, don't try to bypass a camera while you're being watched. I see a junction in the wall, but there's a camera watching it. Shepard, I'm sending a hack to your Omnitool. It will fool the camera, but it'll self-delete after a few seconds. Got it. Security threat clear. Interesting. No, I... I... Oh, I see. The splice is in. Oh, I wanted to see her climb in. 
mingle again. God damn. Cool. Chat to this guy again. Drinks are What can I do for you? I'm curious. What's the craziest thing you've ever served up? Well, there's the Barak. That's a Krogan drink you set on fire, put out, then drink from the scalding hot cup. Well, there's the Weeping Heart. That's a martini with drell skin venom. The venom's pretty mild, though. Oh, wait. A Volus Bina. The alcohol puts you on the floor, and the ammonia lets you clean up the mess you made. If you live. That is terrifying. I guess I'll talk to the boring guy again. I don't think I introduced myself. Uh, Jonah Ashland of Eldfell Ashland Energy? Shepard. Pretty fancy night out for someone worried about his financial future. It was my daughter Aisha's idea. She's got a good heart, though. She's going through a little self-absorbed stage. You make it sound like she's trouble. My love for her is unlimited. She just gives me a lot of opportunities to prove it. But I'm pretty sure she can change. You don't bet against something like that. What is going Not on with my hair? On Rex, let's dance again. <laughs> I do love his giant tuxedo jumpsuit thing. Anybody else interesting to talk to? Don't panic. Oh God. I'll get his attention. To avoid the cameras. What was it? Inconvenient. Oh, it's like it's visual. Excuse me. I think I saw someone doing drugs in the men's room. I see. Were you able to identify the substance used? Red sand. Dispatch, we've got a sand tripper in the bathrooms. Have they tried to compromise the games biotically? Unknown at this time. Moving to confront. Send backup. We're taking care of it, sir. Appreciate the help. You're welcome. You have a good night now. You're clear, Brooks. <sighs> Thanks, Commander. I'll see if I can get to the panic room. And I'll get back oh, to blending there. in. Slow and steady. We'll get to Khan. Uh, talk to you again. Rios. I feel like I should know that name. I did a little acting, then in the 70s during the Blitz, I was named Goodwill Ambassador for Refugees. So I guess this kind of thing doesn't really impress you? Me? No. For the people who can get clothes because you bought a ticket? Much different story. Hmm. Where's the con man? I'll talk to him again. Over here, right? I I ever went in this place. Oh, damn. What are you two up to? Oh, I see not. the security gate. Okay, that's great. But we gotta wait on that until I reach the end of the duct. The thing about Solarian parties is, they all do it too well. I don't follow. My lab group on Sirkesh. All Solarians but me. And all with damn near perfect memories. Oh, that could get awkward. Exactly. It was all about who burnt the cake six months ago, or arguments the two people continue when they meet up once a year. So they never let anything go? Yeah, it was constant one-upmanship. I couldn't keep pace with them if I wanted to. Hmm. Where's the con man? I'm debating whether I should report you to security. Oh, I like a good debate. Would you be so smug if I got you thrown out of here? Possibly. I'd like to see you explain my wicked motives right after you explain why you have a radio in your ear. Well, since I don't see you turning me in either, I gather you're no friend of Khan's. Khan doesn't have friends. Anyone who says otherwise is deluding themselves. Interesting. So is Khan part of your game tonight? No, I simply sheer... No. What do humans call it? I fleece his guests. Then there's no harm in telling me what his weaknesses are. I've studied him. He's ruthless and rich, but not very bright. Temperamental. Doesn't deal well with the unexpected. 
He's also used to letting other people handle things he doesn't understand. Like his security. That's quite an assessment. Do I owe you anything? No. We do what we do because there are wrongs that need righting. The wrongs I address are simply pettier than yours. Then I guess we know where we stand, Mr. Quarn. Enjoy the evening, Commander. Interesting. What do they want me to do? Just mingle still? Uh, um, what? Talk to me, Brooks. I've got a pressure pad and an obstruction detector ahead. I can't disable them from here. Okay. Edie, I need a tech solution. Brooks, stay put. We'll find some junctions and take down the sensors. Okay. Okay. Follow the red wiring. Okay. Well, that didn't help me. I'm at a junction. There's a camera and a guard. I'll just be here. Try not to cough. Look at the guard to select him. Stop looking at me. Excuse audio equipment to distract the selected guard. I need to look at your kitchen. I'm a food inspector. Uh, <clears throat> I'm going to have to see some credentials. Brooks, try it now. Checking the pressure pad. No alarms. Looks good. Follow the red wiring. Again? Hmm. Oh, that's a dead end. Back to this side. There's a junction by the roulette wheels, but it's in plain view of two guards. But you can do something, right? Because my legs are maybe sort of starting to fall asleep a little. Hang in there. We've got this. Is he even looking at this? Like, they're patrolling, right? I can get his attention and say when. You don't need to call for backup. I'm just looking for a game that isn't crap. We, uh... I'm at the storage room grate. Time to hit the lock. Be careful, Brooks. Brooks? Oh, son of a... Hey, Commander. What? What happened? Oh, which one is it? Oh, that one. <laughs> Hello, friend. Hey! Just calm down. I'm trying to do three different things here. Barrels? Sir, we checked out the alarm in storage. It's nothing. Minor accident. Find out who tripped it and get them in my office by end of shift. Now you. What'd you need? I'm sorry, are you with security? I thought you were a friend of mine. You've got the same suit. You... Enjoy your evening. You're clear, Brooks. <laughs> he says right Thanks, in front Commander. of him. I'll see if I can get to the panic room. All mingling. Uh, sure, I'll talk to you again. Or is that not? I suppose I spoke to him too much. Okay, no. Uh, let's play some more Varen Racing. Even, actually, mm, Get your bets in. Five minutes, people. actually, no. I'm gonna go play the, the blackjack thing again. That seems a bit more reasonable. No, no, I'm not running for Citadel Council. I'm running for Zakara Ward City Council. Who are you now? Hi, Elspeth Moraine. I'm running for Zakara Ward City Council. Are you a citizen here? I've had bad experiences with politicians. Who hasn't? That's why I'm running. I got sick of leaders with ties to terra firma or Cerberus or worse. Oh? The ward needs refugee facilities. It needs security. It needs jobs. It needs everything. And hopefully, with a friend like Elijah Khan backing me, I can make it happen. What's your connection to Khan, exactly? He's a campaign contributor. Uh-huh. You may want to do a background check on him. He's dirty. 
like you can't imagine. Oh, not again. I can't believe this. I just got done returning donations from some Terminus pirate woman. Was her name Arya? Yeah, and before that, it was an Asari Spectre Tella something, and before that, there was this Krogan. Do I have a sign on my back saying, exploit me? Yes. Well, you don't exactly come across as formidable. But I'm trying to fix it. I practice glares in the mirror every night. Good luck, Ms. Moraine. Is that it? I'm just standing there awkwardly? Okay. Uh, let's play some blackjack. Okay. So now I think you just need to get to me. I'm on the other side of the security gate. Right, hold on, right. I'm gambling. Have you bypassed the camera back there? Well, I got my side. Yours is still on, though. We need to finish this before someone comes by. Hang tight. I'll get to you. Follow the yellow wiring. Bollocks. Fine. Wait, no, I want to make my money back. Hold on. Hmm, sure, we'll cash out. And then we're going to play one more roulette. Where's the roulette table? It was over... The... Yeah, this way. Let me play, damn it. I want to go lucky number six again. We're going to go 12. I'm going to go... Black again. Any luck with the gate, Commander? Bollocks. It'll be done when it's done. Follow the yellow wiring. Right, we're going six, six, and twelve. <sighs> right, fuck it. I've had enough of gambling. <laughs> I'm losing all that free money that I found. How much did I just lose? Like Ten grand, probably. Um, all right, let's go. Follow the yellow wire, she said. I can't get the security gate to open from here. The junction must be on your side. It might be tricky, just so you know. Have a little faith. I can get his attention, say when. Wait, what? Which one? Follow the yellow wire, right? Or am I just trying to find the panic room? Oh, I had to do something first. That doesn't go anywhere. Neither, okay, so no, I guess it isn't. Look at guard to select him. Alright, but which one? That guy is just looking backwards and forwards. I'll disable the door sensor. Well, bollocks. So you're not going to catch me because you're backwards, so it's you. Wait. Is he going to see me tamper with his camera? Hey, you call that guarding? Suspicious activity. My floor. Bollocks. A guard spotted me. If you act normal, hopefully he'll move on. So you don't miss Sir Kesh at all? God damn it. Not the humidity and not the lack of privacy. But the science was uh, like nowhere else. What did you work on? And what didn't we? Food scanners for the paranoid, chemical bonders, self-cleaning mating pools. Learned a lot, huh? For the mating pools, uh, way more than I wanted to know. <clears throat> Wait, so... The camera doesn't move, is it? There's a huge area to fucking. Maybe I can just scrunch up tight against the wall. That might help, right? There's always back in the shaft. Well, let's not go crazy here. Hey, you call that guarding? Is there a problem you'd like to report, sir? You said turn around.
Nice. You saw nothing. Khan, you and me are gonna have a talk. He's already dead. What the hell? Well, fuck. Hmm. You got me dressed up like this and someone else got to do the shooting. Rex not happy. <laughs> Commander, there's a deletion order on the terminal. Damn it. Everything's been wiped. I don't know if it was him or the killer or... <gasps> when I tripped that alarm, did I screw this up? What are you looking for? Mistakes. Thought so. Whoever it was had to do this fast. They wiped the terminal, but not the comm. Oh, so we can take the comm back to the safe house to scan it, or... Elijah, come crawling back. Guess again. You. I see you've recovered from flopping on the floor like a fish. Name a time and a place. Or you could hide behind voice disguisers for the rest of your life. You're trying to rattle me, so I slip up. You have nothing. All you can do is wait for the hammer to fall. Bring a bigger hammer. Your last try was inadequate. I'm gonna take everything you have, and everything you are. Damn it. <sighs> Sorry, Commander. There wasn't enough time to trace the call. We're not finished. Pull out the data drives. The ones that got wiped? You think we can find something? With Edie, anything's possible. The sooner we get them to her, the sooner we can track down this threat. 